Welcome back to Sippin' with Manny, with Manny, you know, we sippin' with Manny for- Bam! Oh, wrong way. Bam! Corona! Familiar! Cause are you familiar with the com Corona? Corona familiar? Mm, mm, mm. Oh, it's good stuff, folks. <sighs> good stuff. You know, I hope you all had a good fourth, you enjoyed it, you drank a lot of good- Brew, Mexican imports especially, you know, and we kept doing our thing. But let me tell you, folks, let me tell you, folks, you know, even even with all these good brews out, a lot of good beers are coming out. We see the evolution of beers happening. But one thing, the evolution for the educational youth, the cartoons, is crap, garbage, retarded, dumb. And let me tell you this, that's not what we had back in the day. They don't know what Popeye is. Asked my little boy today. He showed him Popeye. He goes, this is weird. But he liked it. He liked it, though. But you know what? They need to have cartoons like that. That's educating the youth. Teaching them something. Like Popeye taught you to eat spinach. Taught you how spinach makes you strong. What happened to Captain Planet? Taught you how to... A superhero who saves the world. Like, actually saves the world. It's not, like, stopping a villain to save the world. He's saving the world by saving the world. You know? Now they have these, um... Cartoons, I don't know, something gumball, amazing gumball. That's dumb. And hey, what's another cartoon you watch? That's dumb. Loudmouth, Loudmouth House or something? That's dumb. You know, it's not what we grew up with. Captain Planets, Popeye, He Man, He Man. You know, it showed you you can be somebody when you're not somebody, you know? What else? What else was there? Uh, you know? Not dumb cartoons, good cartoons, what we had back in the day. Doug, you know, they don't hey even know Arnold. what Doug and Hey Arnold and Rugrats. I showed my kids Invader Zim. Invader Zim. And they're like, what is this? Invader Zim. That's legendary right there. Goku. You know? Dragon they like Dragon Ball, yeah, because that super came out. Cool. Hey, Dragon Ball's Ball. cool. <laughs> but they didn't. they don't know about the good ones like Doug, Pepper Ann. Remember Pepper Ann? She was too cool for seventh grade. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what cartoons you watched when you were little, but I remember when they had one Saturday morning, and every Saturday morning, I wanted to watch those cartoons. The Weekenders, one Saturday morning cartoons. Tom and Jerry, man, those are classics right there. Other classics I could think of right now, not Rugrats. Uh, Rugrats ain't too classical right now. Um, um, the Flintstones. Flintstones? Come on. You know, Flintstones? And now... Now you, you can't even put stuff on cartoons. The other day I saw I saw a clip on Facebook. Ooh, the best one, Pink Panther. Oh, oh yeah, Pink Panther. But anyways, the other day I saw on, on Facebook a clip of Bugs Bunny. He's playing the piano. Do no 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 do playing the piano and someone's coughing in the audience. I wonder what Bugs Bunny did. He got off the piano and shot him with a shotgun or something. You don't even see that on, on cartoons anymore. Stuff like that. I remember there's cartoons where um, like the pit bull, no, the bulldog, the bulldog from Tom and Jerry, you'll be like smoking a cigar. You don't even see that anymore. Or, or where they'll have those old school, those old school gangs that are like, yeah, sing, yeah, sing, yeah, 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 sing. You know, you don't even see that anymore. All you have is these weak little loser cartoons that don't even make sense because they are so censored now to put anything good. Kids don't know anything that, like, you know, that's why they're all like, oh, my God, he called me a girl. And they get all offended. They get all offended because cartoons ain't making them tough anymore like what we had. We had cartoons that's just like, yeah, I'm a, I'm a tough dog. Like, like the bulldog on Tom and Jerry, he was a tough dog. He went and punched him in the face. Or Droopy. Remember Droopy? That little, little um, I don't know what kind of dog he was. He had the cheeks going down like this. And Hey guys, I'm oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and he was a cool dog, you know? Or the Tweety Bird and Sylvester. You know, Tweety Bird was tough. You know? You don't see that anymore. Go back, watch Space Jam, and you'll see how tough they are, and all they did was drink water. Oh, that other one. The yeah. uh, Supersonics. Supersonic. Oh, wait. It's not Supersonic. Um, oh, 
they fly in the... Gargoyles? No. They, they were like of the future. With the... Big bad beetle boards? No. I don't know. Oh, but anyways, folks, like, like I said, beers ever you know, re evolving into great stuff. And you know what? It's because that's our generation. Our generation is evolving the beer industry. But you know what? What happened to our generation evolving the great cartoons to what they should be? You know? That's what I like. I like those old cartoons. Let me name 10 of them off the top of my head. Animaniacs, DuckTales, Looney Tunes, Tiny Tunes, Pinky and the Brain, uh, Pink Panther. I said that one earlier in the show. Uh, two, what's two mean? Yogi. Yogi Bear, dude, that guy was cool. And you know what? That was a cartoon of a bear who was always stealing, like he was stealing Doug. groceries. Eh? You go to people's picnics and just steal. Doug, Doug. Oh, we yeah. named we named Doug and Hair on. We named all those. Robert. But you know what? Rocco's Martin Life. Remember what happened to that? Real you know, monsters. real monsters. Oh, real monsters. So you know what, folks? Arthur. What cartoons did you watch? List them down Doug below. Girls. We'll put them. You know, I want to know what cartoons you watch. Mm, 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 mm. Sailor Moon. Sipping with Manny. They need to toughen up on these cartoons to toughen up the kids. Laters.